Welcome to this video about importing questions to the question bank in Moodle. In this video, we will cover how to import questions from a text file and from other Moodle courses. In the previous video, we covered how to create new multiple choice questions in Moodle. It is also possible to import several multiple choice questions at once to the question bank from a text file. To do this, you will need to structure the questions and answers in a specific format known as Aiken. In order to complete this type of import, you will need to write questions using a plain text editor application, such as Notepad for Windows or TextEdit for Mac. In Notepad, you can navigate to File, Save As, and save your document using a naming convention of your choice, making sure to choose the encoding, which is located at the bottom center of your save screen, as UTF-8. If you are using TextEdit on a Mac computer, go to Format, then click Make Plain Text. This will convert the format to UTF-8. When you click on File, then Save, you can see that Plain Text Encoding is set to Unicode UTF-8. Once you have prepared your document, you can begin typing your questions. Your questions will need to be formatted in a specific way. The question must be all on one line, each answer must start with a single uppercase letter, followed by a period or a right parentheses, then a space. The answer line must immediately follow, starting with the word ANSWER in all caps, followed by a colon, a space, and the letter of the correct answer. It is important to double check the document to see that all questions are formatted in this exact way. If they are not formatted correctly, the questions will not import and you will receive an error message. After finalizing your questions, you will go to File, Save, and Return to your course. On your course page, click More in the horizontal navigation menu, then select Question Bank. In the drop-down menu at the top of the page, select Import. If you want to create a new category for the imported questions, you can do that by selecting Categories in this same drop-down menu. On the Import page, choose Aiken under File Format Options. Click on General and choose the category you want to add these imported questions to. Then choose the text file that you created by selecting Choose a File in the Import Questions from File section. When you are ready, click Import. If you formatted everything correctly, you will see a list of the questions that you created. Click on Continue at the bottom of the screen. Now you can see these questions that you created and imported from your text file have been added to the question bank. You can also import quiz questions from other Moodle courses. For example, let's say that I created some great questions in my microbiology course that I'd like to use in this new course that I am building. Or perhaps there are several instructors teaching different sections of the same microbiology course, but they all want to use the same question bank for quizzes. One way to transfer these questions would be to export the question bank from the old course and import it into the new one. In the old course, click More in the horizontal navigation menu, then select Question Bank. In the drop-down menu at the top of the page, select Export. Choose Moodle XML format in the File Format section, and choose the category you wish to export in the General section. Then select Export Questions to File. Your export file will then download to your downloads folder or to the folder that you have directed your browser to save downloaded files. Now, open the course you want to import these questions into. Click More in the horizontal navigation menu, then select Question Bank. In the drop down menu at the top of the page, select Import. On the Import page, choose Moodle XML format under the File Format options. As before, choose the category you want to add the questions to. Then add the Moodle XML file that you created by selecting Choose a File in the Import Questions from File section. When you are ready, click Import. Once imported, you will see a brief preview screen. Click Continue and you will be taken to the Questions tab where you will see the list of newly imported questions. If you want to learn more about additional formats for importing questions to the question bank, you can click on the blue question marks, then the More Help link to see the Moodle documentation for each format type. 